Andy, you think branding, and most college football fans think Oregon. How have they gone from a team that was known for flashy uniforms and a relationship with Nike to a consistent contender? Well, the thing about it, Maggie, is that with Oregon, it started so much earlier than all the uniforms. It actually started really before Phil Knight at Nike started giving all that money. It started uh, with Rich Brooks kind of getting them to win for the first time in the, in the mid-'90s. And then uh, basically they hire Mike Bellotti. He keeps a lot of the same assistants. Uh, Mike Bellotti hires Chip Kelly. Chip Kelly revolutionizes the offense, turns them into uh, a team with a, a as big an on-field identity as their uniforms and uh, fancy facilities and everything were off the field. And what it did, what all that did, was it created a recognizable look, recognizable style of play, and a recognizable culture that you see that O, you know exactly how they dress how they play, how they win. And I don't know of any program in college football that's done as well, especially considered, I mean, Oregon's in the middle of nowhere, basically. Uh, they're not in a recruiting hotbed. They shouldn't have been able to do this. It's, it's really remarkable what they've done over, really, it's about a 25-year period.